everyone, so this is going to be a pick monkey tutorial on how to add a border to your thumbnail without actually losing the size. So it's actually pretty easy, but sometimes when you do it, it will totally un, you know, mess up the size of your thumbnail, and it's just horrible. Um, so there's actually a couple of tricks to get around this. So this is just a thumbnail that I just edited for a video. And what you want to do is once you're completely happy with it, you want to click this little button here that looks like a down arrow. And that's just going to combine all your image elements. Once you click this, you can't go back and edit anything, so make sure that you really do like it. Um, so what I like to do first is I'll save it just in case I don't like it to my desktop. And then um, I have a backup. So you want to click that combine. And then you want to go down here to this little frame. And you can choose whichever one you want. I usually go with Simple Edge. And here you can adjust the thicknesses of the different lines. Um, and you can change the colors if you wanted it to be, I don't know, whatever you want it to be. Um, you can do so. You can make it nice and bright and fun. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of what you would do. You can change the thickness, like I said. And then you would just click Apply. So now when you go up here to this crop tool and you go to resize, you'll see that it changed it. It's supposed to be 1280 by 720. Now it's 1304 by 744. So when you actually go in to put it into um, YouTube, it's going to be messed up. And you don't want that. So you want to uncheck keep proportions and then you can go ahead in and resize it to 1280 by 720. And nothing's going to be messed up. It's going to be your same image. It's just going to be the correct size for YouTube. So you just want to click apply and then go ahead in and save it. So that's how you guys add a border. I'm gonna type this, add a border. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to let me know down below. And if there's any other um, tutorials in PicMonkey you would like to see, please let me know in a comment and I'll try my best to address them. Thanks guys, bye.